Hello there, my name is Mark, and today I'll be telling you a little bit about the pH experiments I did with red cabbage. So here I'll be telling you my process and hypothesis that I came up with while I was used while I was doing this experiment. Off to the right, you can see. Oh, I'll talk about that a little bit later. So the process is you want to cut up some red cabbage. Then you want to boil the leaves in water till the water turns purple. Let the water cool, cool. Then what I did was I poured a quarter cup of liquids that I wanted to test inside clear cups. Added a tablespoon of purple water to the clear cups. Observed the color change and recorded the color. And then I repeated steps four and five three times over. And then my hypothesis was if more flavin water, which is this purple water, that is needed is added to the solution, then it will skew the results and make it drift the pH closer to 7 or neutral. Because water usually has a pH of near 7, uh, as more flavin water is added, it will cause the pH to drift closer towards, closer towards neutral, giving a darker blue or greenish color. And so why does, why does red cabbage water have this effect? Red cabbage contains a chemical called flavin, which is why we're using it, and it can be extracted by boiling the cabbage. And flavin reacts with the acidity of different liquids and changes color based off of that. And so now I'm going to go to my results. So what were my findings? Off to the top, top right here, you can see my, uh, my data the raw data, the RGB values of the different liquids that I got. So I found that my hypothesis was correct. As a more flavin water was added, the solution became darker, usually. This was not the case for Diet Coke, where the solution became brighter. Off in the bottom right, you can see a graph that I've made graphing the R value versus tablespoons of flavin water. So orange is orange juice, green is lemonade, red is Diet Coke, and blue is water. And as you can see with orange juice, lemonade, and water, as more flavin water is added, they get darker. However, with Diet Coke, the... Um, the R value increases and the solution got a little bit brighter. Uh, I'm not sure why this occurred. However, I believe it's probably due to the food coloring that's contained within Diet Coke. Uh, probably skewing the results. Uh, and so that's, that's all I have to say for today. Thank you all for listening.